Hi, this is Dr. Kevin Herman here to talk to you from New Jersey Endovascular and Amputation Prevention. I'm going to talk to you today about chronic venous disease or chronic venous insufficiency. For short, we could call it CVI. CVI affects over 200,000 Americans per year. It is a very common disease and can manifest itself with the following symptoms. Patients can complain of pain, heaviness of their legs, itchiness, restless leg syndrome. People that suffer from chronic venous insufficiency can see varicose veins in their legs, discoloration and a hardness or leathery feeling to their skin, as well as possibly venous ulceration. Although chronic venous insufficiency or CVI is not life-threatening, it can affect people's lives in a meaningful way. Treatment options include both conservative treatment options which would be diet, exercise, as well as leg elevation and compression stockings or compression pumps. Other, there are other minimally invasive techniques as well to help patients manage their symptoms of CVI, which would include minimally invasive uh, laser or radiofrequency ablation of the vein in order to close the vein that is leaking, resulting in those symptoms. Other forms of venous disease include deep venous insufficiency, which can affect the blood flow return back to the heart. In those cases, there's an area of narrowing, usually in the pelvic region. This can be treated by placing a stent inside the blood vessel in order to prop it open and improve the blood flow. But overall, whether one is suffering from chronic venous insufficiency, both conservative as well as minimally invasive treatment options are available and can be helpful in managing these symptoms.